guys come in here i just wanted to walk you through your introduction assignment so basically what's going to happen is you can use your mind map or you can use your heart and you're going to decide on a story it doesn't have to be from the mind map or the heart but that's just ways to generate ideas what you're going to do is you're going to decide what personal story you're willing to share with me and you're going to first start it off different ways so sometimes when we start our story off we don't start it the way we want to so by friday you're going to have the whole story written but today what you're what i want you to do is i want you to start it out three different ways so the story that i'm going to tell is the story about how i found out that my son my second son was a boy and how like disappointed i was like i had major gender disappointment which is crazy because like i was so happy to be pregnant but i was so sad that he was a boy so there are different ways you can start your story i could start with dialogue i could tell you exactly what was said i could tell you an idea or a thought and it's okay if you don't know exactly what was thought, what was you know what was going through your head kind of you don't know the exact thoughts you don't know the exact words always and so it's okay to kind of not fib it up but put what you think could have been said okay you can start with an action you can start with a question or you can start with description so on the document i have given you three of my examples the first one is as i drove to the sneak peek appointment i thought about how excited i was the second one i have is girl or boy so I start with a question. The third one is, Charlie, what do you think it would be, a brother or a sister? And so you can start your story off different ways. Today what you need to do, simple, easy, is you're going to come up with three different ways you're going to start your story off. It can be different dialogue. It can be different things. You could start in different parts of the story. You could start with a question. You could start with an idea. But I want you to start it three different ways. And then tomorrow we'll talk about adding more detail.